Hey, what's up guys? Hope everybody's doing well and having a great day. In this video, I'm going to take you guys to two different locations and we're going to see what look like strange portals in the day and nighttime sky. Very bizarre video footage you'll, you'll definitely want to stick around for. Also in this video, I've got bonus footage of more non-stop lightning. I've also got footage of the recent supermoon. Well, it goes back a, a few days. Video sent in by Heather out of Maysville, Virginia. She did an excellent job. She was driving down the road while filming the supermoon as it was coming up above the horizon. She zoomed in really close. I don't know how she kept the camera this still while she was driving down the road filming the awesome supermoon visible from Maysville, Virginia. Thank you, Heather. Really appreciate that. I've also got more video footage of what I'm calling super lightning. The sky absolutely supercharged. Video footage sent in by Yvette. Not sure of the location, but as you can clearly see, there's no missing the, the sky sky bursting with color with bright pinks and purple and white and sometimes you'll see orange mixed in over there the video is over five minutes long so what i'm going to do is put it in fast forward here and we'll check out the the first minute of the, of the video footage this went on for a long long time and it's like what we've been seeing before the sky just seems to be loaded with an abundance of energy showing up in various colors we're seeing green blue purple right here we're primarily seeing light purple light pink and sometimes yellow and white another excellent video of super lightning in the skies above planet earth coming over here to the home page of the website today's feature photos of a golden sky sent in by quentin parton out of honey grove texas as storms were moving through the area above honey grove i also have video footage out of texas involving not gold skies but orange skies we're going to start in oklahoma go to texas these are just cool looking skies Catherine john out of Hugo, Oklahoma, September 20th of 2023. She took this video as she was pulling out of a parking lot, looked up and noticed the sky was just loaded with orange and yellow and, and light gold and almost a dark pink at times. Super cool, very low to the ground clouds above Hugo, Oklahoma. Going from Oklahoma to Texas, this segment has narration. It was sent in by Christine and Renee. It goes back to September 8th of, of 2023 out of Santo, Texas. And you can see what they were filming these spectacular beams on the horizon at sunset she said she was going to share this video with me and i greatly appreciate that thank you so much for sharing that is one cool sky visible from santo texas going from texas down to australia we're in south australia adelaide australia september 22nd of 2023 this is a view of the nighttime sky by trey and toby and they noticed these mysterious stationary lights very low to the ground they didn't move this video was over 10 minutes long and these lights remained in the same location they didn't move they weren't making any noise they're not chinese lanterns they're not helicopters and they're definitely not airplanes they remained white there's another smaller one way back here off in the distance and i'm sharing this video with you guys because it kind of aligns with the the next video we're going to see of what looked like portals way off in the distance in the daytime sky as the sun was setting this is obviously after dark from south australia in adelaide and notice how the sky almost looks like it's moving very bizarre video Once once again, out of Southern Australia by Trey and Toby. I'm going to step this forward just a little bit because the video was over 12 minutes long. And notice when I put it in fast forward, you can really see how that sky almost looks like it's just loaded with energy and the camera is detecting it or it's simply some sort of a camera artifact and it's really not doing that. But it could be. I don't know. I've never seen anything quite like that, to be honest. But as you can see, the lights do not move. They're not Chinese lanterns. If they were, they would have been long gone and they would have already extinguished their light and you wouldn't even be able to see them. We are almost nine minutes into this video and it goes on for another two minutes. The lights do not move. The sky continues to look like it's just loaded with energy. Don't know what these mysterious lights were. Spotted by Trey and Toby from South Australia out of Adelaide. This next video that we're going to see has similarities to the one we just saw out of Australia. However, it was as the sun was setting. Video taken by Dave 
from August the 7th of 2023 at 6.17 p.m. He sent me two videos. The first one was about 30 seconds long, and the second video he shared with me was right around two minutes long. They were both of the same thing. These observations over here, off in the distance, you see what looked like some sort of lights, maybe portals, something in the sky that just looked out of place. And they did not move. Um, the entire time he recorded these things, whatever they may have been, don't claim to know, guys. Simply sharing what Dave saw in the sky, and I'm not sure of the location. Don't claim to know what these things are, guys. They're just very mysterious observations that were noticed by Dave. Both these videos are unedited. All I did was zoom in just to get a closer look at what Dave noticed way off in the distance at sunset. You can see the sky's kind of orange, and the sun's over here to the right. These things aren't airplanes. They're not helicopters. As you're going to see here in in just a few seconds, you're going to see an airplane enter the field of view and exit the field of view. These things did not move the entire time he saw these things, or at least the entire time he filmed them with his recording device. They remained stationary, like they could have been part of something larger that we just simply can't see, like maybe they were some sort of portals off in the distance. At times, you're going to see a secondary light behind the middle one and behind the one over here on the far left. That's the only thing that changes during the entire length of this video. These things remain stationary. At times I was wondering, okay, are these part of something larger? Because they do remain so stationary. They're not moving like airplanes would move. If, if these were airplanes, they would already be in a, in a much different location, and they probably wouldn't even have the same appearance. Here in just a second, you're going to see an airplane enter the field of view over here and cross the screen from right to left. So these clearly are not airplanes. I don't believe they're parachutes because they're maintaining the same altitude. They're not moving. They're, they're highly stationary. Stationary. These things don't move, again, the entire length of this video footage. So, very mysterious observation by Dave. Video footage from August 7th of 2023 at 6.17 p.m. Here comes the airplane right there. See it? That's a close view airplane. The airplane was very close to his location. So it obviously looks nothing like the, the lights off in the distance, whatever they may be. I don't know what those are. I've never seen anything quite like that. They look to be pretty good size. How far away they are, it's difficult to tell. And coming up right here, I modified a, a couple of segments of the video, tried to zoom in even a little bit closer, and I adjusted the lighting and color and, and various things, just trying to pull forward any possible features that may or may not have been there and there were none they remained about the same they looked just like they did in the original video format that again was unedited all i did was zoom in on these very mysterious objects and this next segment coming up is just a simple light inversion light is dark dark is light and there they are and you can see the secondary light right there behind that one and at times right there there's a, a secondary light that also remains stationary when it was visible it wasn't visible all of the time but you can see one there and right there you can see one. And coming up, I did one more modification. And in this next modification, you're able to, to see the secondary light, the smaller light behind. See it right there? There's one there, and you're going to see one over here. Isn't that wild? And they didn't move the entire length of the video that was over three minutes long. If those were airplanes, they would have been long gone. In three minutes' time, they would have been completely out of the field of view. They remained stationary the entire time. I don't think they were clouds because they would have changed shape. Some sort of a very mysterious observation, a row of bright what looked like portals off in the distance. Dave observed these in August of 2023. A couple of months later, Hope sees the same thing in the sky. October 2nd at 4.53 p.m. There were two, not three, but like Dave's, they remained stationary. They almost looked like some sort of bright portals in the sky. They didn't change shape. They had no blinking type of lights. They had no wings, no type of recognizable features, just unusual stationary lights in the daytime sky. Also, as the sun was getting ready to set. These next segments, I just simply modified the original format, looking for possible features that we might recognize, wings, tail fins, maybe a a propeller anything like that and nothing like that showed up here I zoomed in even closer on each of the the two objects that were in the the daytime sky they were very noticeable there was no missing these things like Dave's these were very bright 
unusual lights in the evening sky as the sun was getting ready to dip below the horizon. Thank you, Hope. Really appreciate that. Thanks for the photos and videos, guys. Keep them coming. If you guys have any photos you'd like to share, you can send those to reports at MrMBB333.com. If you guys have any videos you'd like to share that are too large to attach to the email, come over here to the homepage of the website. You can always find a link down below in the description box. Look for this red banner that says, Have a Large Video. It's a Dropbox. Drag and drop your video into the Dropbox. Please include your first name, date, and location, and I'll take it from there. Thanks for watching. Have a super day, and be safe out there.